I've had my bicycle, my shitty Schwinn, and a gas can on the handlebars so many times, riding to get two gallons of gas or a gallon of gas just to start a bike that I put months into. You know, like you wheel it off the lift and you hear a bolt or drop or a nut drop and you're like, oh, I wonder what the fuck that was. Like, you know when you lose one and you're like, the flashlight, you're like, fuck, I don't know where it is. And it's usually, it, they'll end up in such weird places like on top of the oil pump or like behind the oil line. I've built a bike and like three months later see and I'll be like that's that fucking bolt like I thought it was in the cuff of my pants I believed in spontaneous combustion for like three years because of one thing I lost because I looked for it for a month so that feeling when you first wheel it off and you first put in that gas man it's fucking and then you'll start it and somehow the throttle sticks for whatever reason, like the throttle will never stick again, but that first time it's like, ah, shut it down. You know, there's no kill switch. You pull the plug wires, like all that shit's so fun. Like it's so Frankenstein. I mean, in 20 years, I've seen so many trends come and go. I stay pretty consistent with what I like. You know, I'm a bird skater. That would have been more popular if I skated street, but I like skating bird more. I'm not gonna change the way I feel. Like, that's what I like. Those first years of having the motorcycle, you're looking at magazines at uh, bookstores and stuff, and they didn't relate to you at all. You'd find like one that would be labeled old school chopper, you know, you're like, oh wow, there's one cool bike in it. And then I went to Tower Records and I seen this little magazine, Dice. It's like, man, this is fucking bitchin'. Like, what the fuck is this? That was 2005 or something like that. And Scott Craig's bike, he had a panhead in there. And I just was like, this is it. Like, this is what we need to be doing. This is the shit. But that's like this weird sportster panhead knucklehead thing. It's just, uh, it's, it's just something different. You know, like I, I keep having like weird, I mean a lot of rad commentary, a lot of people like really stoked and it feels great. But a lot of people kind of like, why? It's like, well, why not? Because I can, because I want to. Josh Kirby has said, everyone's trying to make their sportster look like a knucklehead. You're the asshole trying to make your knucklehead look like a sportster. <laughs> it was like the best compliment. I was like, right, get an XLCH and fucking tell me it's not fun. <laughs>